Okay, still trudging. I don't even know if that's a word. Probably is. Yeah, I'm still trudging along. That dog, if he don't start paying attention, he's gonna get run over. Boy. It's like he knew I was talking about him. <laughs> it's like he's waiting for me. Well. I think he wants to be friends. <laughs> it's like he's waiting for me. Hey, go home. No. This area right here now. This is not your tourist area. There's no bright lights. There's no nightlife. There's... Well... How do I put it? <laughs> it's just a dusty road. But this is the way it is in the Philippines. A lot of people have misconceptions. They think Barrio Barreto is the Philippines. Angeles City and Walking Street is the Philippines. It's not. They're like border towns. Tourist areas. But, hey, gotta love those areas. And that's, believe it or not, there's women all over the Philippines. Used to go to Barrio Barreto. Used to go to Walking Street, Fields Avenue. You were beautiful, sexy, spoke English. Hey, you had a job. And believe it or not, a lot of the young ladies got husbands. No. That's a good thing. Anytime you can raise out from poverty into a better life, I salute you. The pandemic now is, it's causing a lot of stress economic hardship okay well, there's a resort here I don't know if it's open yet. maybe they'll let me in anyway actually been here swimming before. It's pretty nice. But I can tell you already 
Judging from the lack of vehicles, it's not in operation. So, no need to walk over there. It's going to be locked. Well, the resort was closed. This is beautiful here. I'm actually very close to where Mark from Overstay Road used to stay. He stayed down the road here. And I want to wish everybody a Happy New Year! See, these guys get close to you, <laughs> I tell you. Okay. Gonna go down a little bit further than probably gonna go back. Then I'm gonna end up probably in Barreto.
like to live down in this area. Fact is, I'm about 99% sure I would not like to live here. Okay, I'll go down and tell them. I get to Hollywood and Vine. I'll show you where that's at. I almost turned around right there, but something told me keep pushing. It's not like I got something to do. It's only New Year's Eve. Yeah, if you'd have seen me in my younger days. <laughs> I would not, I would not be sober right now. That's a fact. Especially here in the Philippines, oh, we start drinking seven in the morning. But those were the good days. These are gone. I mean, here we're worried about COVID-19. I'm not even sure it's contagious. I, I don't know. I know the United States has a lot of uh, fatalities and I'm really sorry for that and our hearts go out for 